Hello. <clears throat> this is the daily reading. The energies for April, I believe it's Monday the 16th, 2018. I hope you're doing what? Amazing. <laughs> so, a briefly brief talk about astrology. Today we have a new moon in Aries. So, that new moon in Aries is... Um, you may want to resolve everything really fast today or moving forward with the new moon in Aries, okay? So this is a reminder for you to slow down, to make great, better decisions and proceed at a more comfortable pace so you don't make mistakes or um, jump to conclusions, okay? So also Aries is still in the sun. That's lots of Aries energy. So there's lots of like spontaneity, wanting to do things, um, you know, take control of a situation and do things freely. So that's why that little warning came out about doing things at a comfortable pace. Okay. So let's see what we have for you for April 16th. Spirit, what do you have for everyone for April 16th? You have the Page of Rods. You have the Five of Cups. You have the Three of Rods. Internally, you have the Ten of Cups. Externally, you have the Five of Swords. All in the upright. Hmm. Okay, so today <laughs> there's that Aries energy coming in from the moon for sure, okay? So this is about having that new eagerness, okay? To make things happen, to start things, to solve problems, to do things quickly. And um, also feeling like you want something new, having an enthusiasm to start something new, okay? Um, be careful for loss. I'm hearing two things with this. Be careful of doing things so fast that you're not paying attention that you lose out. Okay, that you lose out on um, what it is that you were trying to accomplish. Okay, because there were two things or something, as you see with the two cups in the back, that you didn't see, that you weren't paying attention to because you were so focused on um, making things happen at that like specific moment. Okay. Also... No, Spirit's telling me to keep going. So next you have the Three of Rods. And this means that you have to put in small bits of energy. It's so interesting that what I just told you is exactly what the reading is about today. So it's about putting in small bits of energy and then waiting on things to happen. It's not just about jumping right into things and letting things happen as the Page of Rods does. Because the Page of Rods is like a child, okay? So it's about taking your time, paying attention to what it is that you do have, um, not letting small details flip through your fingers and taking your time pacing yourself, okay? Internally, you want perfection or you feel really good today, okay? This could be in love, this could be in any situation, but mainly it's like you're reaching your, op you're reaching your goals, you feel happy, peaceful, um, this is a very good time. You may um, be spending time with the person that you love today. Okay. In your environment, you have the five of swords and this is an opportunity. This could be an opportunity to go back through the same things that you were going through before. Okay. So you have an opportunity to see problems and issues before they happen. And that's what this is. Because you're embodying this energy, it could accompany this and cause you to be reckless, which that five of cups is there to show you that that is what could happen. You could be missing out on something, but this is just a reminder to take steps one pace at a time okay to get to where you want to go so let's see what the extend or, or extend it what your oracle card will be balance <laughs> It says, I bring a state of perfect harmony into my world and do so without judgment, okay? This is about finding balance in your life, remember? 
<laughs> taking things one step at a time, having pace, okay? Finding that balance, finding that equal space. Okay, um, so it's good for you to have energy wanting things to happen. It's also good for you to um, be slow as well. Okay, so it's almost like these two things are working together. The fact that there is failure or could be failure and the fact that you have this childish enthusiasm is working together. But it's about finding that balance and allowing things to take their steps. You know what I mean? Like take it one step at a time okay so thank you very much for listening i will see you tomorrow i love you very much love and light bye bye